what's up you guys and welcome back to my channel so i was going back and forth a little bit you know deciding if i should do a voiceover on this video or not but i decided that it's been a long time since we talked like chatting like this so yeah we're gonna do that these nails, as you might can tell from the beginning of the video, they have just been extended with some clear gel and they have not been built up or anything, it's just the extension and now I'm going in with some white gel paint to create this kind of background. So these nails are gonna get crystalled up like crazy. And we like that. Here I'm actually going in with Diamond, the super famous Light Elegance Diamond. If you don't have this in your collection, then what are you doing? Go grab it. You need it because you can use it for anything. Uh, the cool thing with Diamond is that you can actually put it over any um, color and it's gonna tweak so you can create like a black diamond or a, a, well there's actually a black diamond but you can create a blue diamond or a yellow diamond or whatever you want to do so here I am going in with black tie and I am actually putting this underneath because I'm gonna put something else on top of this as well and it is actually um, it's it's actually not called a glitter gel but in my opinion, it kind of, well, it is a glitter gel because it has glitter in it. Here it is. <laughs> it is called Lover's Lane. It is absolutely amazing. I actually did a video way back. Uh, I think it's called like the bad battle of the black glitters or something because people are always looking for a nice black glitter. So... I have this one in that video, but if you are interested in looking into what glitter gels in black that Light Elegance has, you can um, just, I was going to say Google that, but search it in, on YouTube. And I am applying this underneath because it has those glitter flakes and I wanted to add maybe a little bit more thickness of it so it really gets super opaque. So that's why I put it underneath because if I would have put it on top it would have been super bulky and I hate bulky nails so here I'm going in with one step my favorite gel of all time <laughs> I love it to death it's like my number one go-to gel you guys probably know this already so here I'm encapsulating everything that I just did and same thing here for the see-through nails the reason why I'm encapsulating the white gel paint and also the diamond is because of course I don't want to have like a string of gel on top of the nail and you know you're gonna see why in a second but here the nails are finished filed and now we're moving on to the exciting part spider gel but this is not spider gel this is actually gel paint white gel paint So you can do or create spider gel designs just using a regular gel paint. So what I did is that I kind of swirled into the gel to make it a little bit more runny. And then I am just dragging that across the nail. And by the way, don't do what I just did when I take my bare hands on the gel and kind of remove those little lumps on the side. Don't do that. Please, please. Oh my God. Please use uh, gloves don't do this with your bare hands please please I'm I'm setting a very bad example here just don't do what I do please don't uh, because it will cause allergies in the future so just be careful with that another way you can do this is actually to use gloves so put a little bit of gel paint between your index finger and your thumb and then you kind of bounce it a little bit and then drag it on top of the nail and you're gonna get the same effect maybe the the lines will maybe get a little bit thinner even so right now i'm moving on to crystals because you know we love crystals and all the crystals that i'm using here are available at moonflare.se and for now you can only buy our products if you are located in sweden however 
because we love you guys so much. We are working day and night to actually convert our web shop so that it will be international. And we have a date in mind. We're not going to go official with a date yet because, you know, something could happen. But if we are lucky, it might even happen this month. Oh, yeah. So all these products will be available at Moon Flare. And I'm just using a bunch of different sizes for uh, Crystal AB, you know, with the shimmer effect. And by the way, if you didn't know this, Crystal AB was actually designed by Christian Dior. So if you're wearing Crystal AB, like real Swarovski Crystal ABs, then you have Christian Dior design crystals on your nails. Pretty fancy. Here I am moving on to the see-through nails and right before I add any type of crystal, I just add a little bit of gel to that specific place where I want to add crystal. So first I do a base layer and then I add a little bit more gel where I want the crystals to go. So here you can see that you have to move fast because they're going to run, obviously. Right here, I'm actually going in with some caviar beads. These are also available at Moon Flare. And oh my God, this is one of my favorite crystals. Uh, flame, Crystal AB Flame. It is amazing. The, the big one in the center right here. And then I'm just filling it up with different sizes around that. And also filling up with some silver uh, caviar beads. And as you can see, the easiest way to apply uh, caviar beads is to use a dotting tool or even uh, the one of my nail art brushes, uh, like Swirly. And here I'm just taking a little bit of extra gel to go around the crystals, make sure that everything is secured. So that is something also that is really important when that you uh, that you really secure your crystals. So here I'm going in with some super shiny making sure that I'm not covering the crystals at all because if you cover them up you will lose the facets of the crystal and they will go dead pretty much they will lose all the sparkle and everything so make sure that you never never ever go over the crystals a little quick Swarovski update for you if you are following me on my other social media like Instagram uh, you might have seen that I went to London not long ago to attend the first uh, Swarovski Crystal Beauty Academy Swarovski education or educator training. Oh my god. And uh, just to observe because we are taking that to Scandinavia and Benelux. So keep your eyes open because amazing stuff is going to happen soon. I'm going to announce that in my... Swarovski London vlog later so just uh, keep an eye up for that also make sure that you don't miss out on my other classes I have some classes planned for Oslo this weekend so you better check that out I have some classes in Stockholm and then we have a moon flare event coming up on April 27 so make sure to check out my website, selenaradin.com, if you want to know more about my classes. And hope you like this video. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.